Hello everybody and welcome back to the mod lock. We are jumping in again and this time we're jumping in as Arachna once more. Seeing what we can do as her today. We have quite a lot done. Dark Path is probably our best bet right now. Um, we also have the beast that we can go for as well. I, I gotta say, I think Dark Path is probably our better bet. But we can go for uh, the beast if the run, if the run kind of feels right for it. Dude, can you get back in the web please? Thank you. Thank you. Good sir, thank you. For the question of the day today, this is one that was left in my Discord. If you could travel to a time period but you couldn't travel back, what would you pick? I really don't know, because it's like, you could say future, but I feel like the future's gonna be worse. <laughs> You're like, we don't really know what that holds, so I don't really know how to feel about that. Ooh, we get the Satanic Bible off of that. Nice. That's a that's a very good pickup. Um, I'm not gonna pop it yet, though, because I do not want a Devil Deal off of my um, boss on this floor. I'd rather not. Can I? Yeah. Come on. Oh, yes. That was perfection itself. That was beautiful. Yeah, I think that's a really, really good question. Because it's like, there's so much risk involved in that. There's so much, like, you don't know. And so much that, like, could go wrong. And I don't know. It depends. If you have a, like, period of time that you're really into or you've researched really heavily, then I guess it makes a bit more sense. And I guess you can kind of easier vet that out. I don't really know, though. I, I personally, I'd have a, I have a really hard time sort of thinking of when that time period would be for me. I, I'm really not quite sure. By the way, I'm desperately looking for the secret rooms right now and desperately failing. Okay, there's, there's a secret room. And we get a bunch of these fellas. Hello. This could give us enough money to uh, get something from our shop and it indeed did. Don't get hit by the spiders. I'm a little annoyed that a lot of the spiders just perished there. Second secret room, we're not so sure about. I don't know why I need to let this uh, bomb blow up, but I just do. Uh, yeah, second secret room, we're not so sure about, but it very easily could be off of one of the rooms that we haven't yet been able to test. I'll just check this out as well, just in case. Okay, both of those have been checked. Go for that as well. There, that is. Shop-wise, ooh, does BFF affect our spiders? I don't think it does. BFF's kind of an interesting one. I like it, but I think we should roll. F I think we should roll a bit deeper, to be honest. I think we should go for something like um, Hive Mind or something along those lines. I really don't want to blow up the machine, but I really want to blow up. Okay, I'm just gonna leave this guy. I'm sorry. Right, let's let's roll a little bit deeper and try and get something. Okay, I'm gonna have to take Broken Murdom. I'm telling you now, I'm gonna have to take Broken Murdom. And what would you give me otherwise? Okay. No problem. Yeah, I gotta say. Broken Murdom is so good. There's two of one pill. I'll definitely take it. It's double puberty. Thank you. Puberty. puberty. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm actually having a quite a hard time thinking of when that would be for me. Um, if you guys have some more insight or there's like a specific period that you've really like heavily looked into or really heavily favor, I'd definitely be interested to know. I love these sort of questions of the day, because everyone has very, very varied answers. And even people that have the same answer might have very, very different reasons. Um, I probably should have just used Satanic Bible here, although, actually, maybe not, because I think it just makes it so that the Cuban meat costs hearts, so that's fine. Um, we'll pop that. Health is very, very good for our first floor, so this is looking a little bit, a little bit more beast-worthy. I'm probably not, unless our health gets a really good state, going to use Satanic Bible, um before the um before the like end of the floor i want to use it after my boss because i just don't want to be trading health for uh, devil deals on my boss items or missing out on boss items i realize they could be very lucrative could be very powerful but there's also just as equal a chance that they might not be good at all so i don't want to take that risk right now also one thing to note here as well that i didn't really think about broken murder plus our egg sack is going to be really really nice here because enemies are going to get a little bit more stuck than they otherwise would a little bit more stuck than the otherwise would. Are you? Oh, dude, come on now. Are you in that egg sack? You are. Nice. Dude, those spiders are BS. Fat BS. I tell you now. They are. This was a good room, though. I'm going to do my boss straight away because we have so many spiders to work with. And also, we haven't used Satanic Bible yet, which I think is great for us. Hopefully, we don't lose too many spiders to just these. 
Go, my fairy little friends. Not really fairy. I mean, spiders are kind of fairy. The ones in this game don't look too fairy, but I suppose they technically are. Okay, nice. That was a good, clean kill. We got that as well. We're going to take Angel Deal here. Um, yeah, we'll take Angel Deal here. I do believe taking Devil Deals from the book now does give Devil precedence. We do have to be careful about that. Um, let's head back and try and find our item room real quick. I'm a little annoyed that I lost the health that I did. But at the same time, I'm not really that annoyed because I know that I'm going to be able to um, recoup my losses reasonably easy. <laughs> do these guys get webbed? Maybe, but it's very, very hard to tell. Okay, they do. It's very, very hard to tell because they keep jumping away from my webs. Okay, that room went pretty well. And now we can freely use our book. Because we've already been to our um, our boss fight. Uh, that would have been kind of good with BFF, to be honest. It's a little bit of a shame that I didn't ended up not taking BFF there. But not a terrible item to get regardless. Just because it allows us to have a little bit more control over our damage at range if we should need that, which I'm hoping we don't, but I feel like having it there as an availability is not a bad thing. Secret room-wise, are we looking for much here? I See, I want to be looking for secret rooms because BD1P has been uh, a little a little goober and got like three R keys over the course of all of his runs. He did every single deleted mark, including Greedia, in three runs. Every single mark. He didn't die as him. So, BD1P has beaten me at this stage, I think. I think even with the, the marks that I've lost just off the deleted so far, he'd, he's already beaten me. Oh, that's nice. Which is a bit of a shame. But at the same time, I was kind of expecting... Ooh. Um, I'm going to hold on to that for now. We can get some... Because we're already halfway charged. We can get some extra charges out of that later on. But giving, giving us an extra two uh, black hearts when we need it is pretty nice. Let's go down to the next floor. See just how we do. See just how we do. And, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm probably feeling a beast run here. I feel like this is going well for a beast run. The one thing we're missing, really, is, like, um, uh, like a tier modifier. Something that's going to help us out there. Because we've, we've got the defense on Fleek. Um, but the thing is, we're not going to have spiders for all that long when it gets to the beast fight. So, I really don't want to be setting ourselves up to rely on having that. Because I feel like that could be a really, really bad thing for us. Um, I'm really trying to make the most of my web stack at the minute, so even you, I'm gonna... Oh, damn it. Okay, so now we can... We could pop our thingy here, but I'm not gonna bother. I'm gonna wait for my boss fight, which I hope I find swiftly, because I'll be missing out on charges otherwise. But if we don't, we don't. I'd just rather get an angel deal, to be honest. We'll see how that goes. Okay, these guys, I'm gonna say, we're not gonna end up getting the kills from those guys, so let's not worry about that. Damn it, it's really annoying when the spiders end up killing things because we don't get any web sacks for that and it wastes the spiders for later. I wouldn't get a single one in that room. That's just a shame. Thank you, Broken Murdom. Beautiful. Quite a few more there. And then here's our boss. So now we get to go use that and then use that and then use that. And we get one of those. And now health is looking very good. Of course, we get a bit, little bit unfortunate with this. We've already done Mega Saints. We don't have to worry about that. Spear of Destiny obviously isn't that good. We don't really care about that all, so much, all that much. But it's something to have, so why not? I mean, that was incredible. Everything turned into a web in this room. Holy. That's beautiful. We still got our item room to find. Let's go find that. See what I can do with our webs here. But we really don't need many more spiders for this floor. So I'm not super worrying about it. We're just getting what we can get. And we're doing well of it as well. We're getting a lot of special ones. They definitely reduced the amount of special spiders you can get as this character. Um, before it used to be kind of redonkulous. Um, so that is it is a good thing that they reduced that. Um, I'm, I'm pretty happy with where it stands now. Of course we went every which way apart from the item room. Which is always the case. We only have one key remaining which does... Scare me a little bit for the future flaws, but we'll just get over it. The money room that has no money in it, sadly. Damn. Okay, there was another enemy in that room. I did not know where they were. That's a fantastic item to grab. That definitely bolsters me for doing the beast a little more. I'm a little more happy to go ahead. And now we have two extra webbed hearts too, which is really nice. 
that's going to mean we can just create more spiders as we go. And I think this is a pretty set in stone run. I mean, arachna runs tend to be. Um, apart from, like, basically the only way it can go bad as hair is if you have some really, really horrible early flaws. Otherwise, you're normally in a pretty reasonably good situation to stay alive. Um... Yeah, I'm gonna say it's not it's not too hard at all. One second, I'm gonna need to pause for just a minute here. One sec. Right, let's continue onwards. Yeah, so far so good. I really like sinus infection here. Oh, hello. Pill that I do not want right now. Hey, we got a key straight away. I don't have to be worried about um, waiting to get another key now. Damn it! I kind of webbed a little prematurely there, which sounds gross now that I um. Now that I've said that out loud, and I will never say that again, I promise. I did it again. It's kind of hard to web these guys. I'm just not going to bother. Because <laughs> I basically can't find where the enemies are most of the time. I, I got that one. I got that one. Okay. We don't need to use Satanic Bible now at all. Because we already have maximum HP here. Okay, we don't need to use the web in this room. It's not going to do anything. I feel like that secret room below us there. But I'm not going to go for that yet. Ah, that was a bad hit. It's always an annoying when you get hit on your webbed hearts, but then again, your web hearts, I think, I think at least always sit at the top of your health bar, so they're always going to be the first thing to go. So I can't really be too mad about it, because that's literally just how it works. We're not going to get it any other way. Nice. Oh my god, the damage we're putting out right now. We should just go for the boss straight away here, because then we can use our book and get it charged up for the next floor and all that good jazz. And we got Little Chad, which of course is absolutely useless for us. Um, unless we find like a Dark Bum, which honestly, I'm not expecting us to find at this stage in the game. Kind of might want to play that guy, to be honest. I love the fact that the webs have like slightly bigger hitbox than they let on. It's rather nice. We didn't find the item room so far. We keep accidentally missing our item room, which is fine because we're not in a rush to get to Boss Rush right now. So... I don't worry too much about it, but it is still annoying that we keep just coincidentally slipping by. I just throw out a random web there and I'm going to hope for the best. Yeah, it worked out. Exactly what I was hoping for. This is a little more of a, a tragic room for us here. Yeah, I kind of felt like I was going to get hit there. Um, I doubt we're going to get much webbing going on. Just try and use the Spear of Destiny. Okay. Again, another room. We're not going to get much webbing going on here. Just... Play it as is. We'll probably try and go to our shop here, especially with them extra keys. Pyro. Hell yes. Pyro's very nice. I kind of wish we were on Greedier mode right now. That would bolster our success in Greedier mode by quite a bit. Oh, for God's sake. I always get hit by these. We can use that again. Yeah, let's pop in here real quick and see if it's worth it. Ooh. I just might think it is. Um, if we can get ourselves a penny from any which way, I would be very, very happy with that. So let's hope we can. There you go. Car battery, of course, makes our active insane. I don't know if it does anything for our spool. It might. I would expect it won't, but it might. Uh, but getting it for our space bar, I'm not going to say it makes us unkillable, but it gets us pretty darn close. <laughs> it puts us in a situation where we have to take four hits every six rooms in order to not be invincible, which I feel like is probably not going to happen. I feel like it's been, we're going to be okay. Car battery is one of my favourite items in the entire game for many reasons, and this is just one of them. Sadly, that's not secret room. Uh, blah, 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 blah. I'm probably not going to worry about secret room here, to be honest. I know I should be trying to find our key and all that good jazz, but honestly, I just don't have the, uh, <laughs> the patience to do so. I'll try the few common spots, but otherwise... I'm out of here. Down to the next floor. Still haven't found a trinket yet. Obviously, I kind of would like to get an inner child just in case we die, which I doubt, but just in case. Okay, again, we won't get many spiders in this room. Spiders have kind of been the main thing keeping our successes going as much as it is right now. Because although we have good tiers and stuff... Um... What, why didn't those guys... Why didn't the webs work on those guys? What the hell? Okay, let's play this room slow, because we can get quite a lot of spiders out of this room if we do. It does seem that a car battery has no effect on these guys, which I fully expected. 
Dude, gotta be kidding me. There you go. Take our time, we get rewarded for it. Uh, Rerolls items and pickups for a price, may instead destroy them. We do not need that right now. There's our trinket, and it is a very, very good one, too. Very happy to have it. I probably won't be dropping this one, I gotta say. Had a feeling. Deep inside of me. Okay, now we gotta hope for a good shop with this much money. I mean, to be fair, our shops have already been really good. Broken Murdom and, um... Can we get this guy? Yes, we can. Broken Murdom and Car Battery have been two very good items for us to get. Oh, 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 oh. that room was precious. Okay, let's just quickly go and drop this in our item room. This is on the Depths 1. So we've now got a trinket in there for our red key. If we should... So if we should choose to use that. I believe Inner Child is allowed. I think any respawn that doesn't respawn you as another character is allowed. Um, so that's fine. I wasn't entirely sure about that to start with. There it is. Hive Mind. Fantastic. We'll also go and pop this. It's sad that this doesn't work with Car Battery, but yeah. Just getting hi um, Hive Mind there is pretty insane. And 99 bombs, while not insane, it's pretty darn useful. Like, <laughs> it, it, we get to use those on the beast fight and do a good job of them, so I'm pretty happy with that. Don't forget our full card on the next floor as well, if we can. We've seen pretty much everything we need to see this floor. I'm not in, an, I'm not in a particular rush here, but there's no point sticking around if we don't need to stick around sort of thing. These hive mind spiders, yeah, they're going to demolish this guy. We really need to be focusing on uh, spider work here. Blood clot is cost fantastic. The body, actually, the body isn't great because it gives us webbed hearts, which we don't really need because they're they're less value. But they do increase our spider generation, which I feel like is a pretty important part of our kit with hive mind. So I'm gonna take that. I'm a little worried about the fact that we're not really gonna get many spiders throughout the beast fight. I am a, a very, very um, happy about how absolutely buff our character looks right now. That is quite something. Yeah, now now we just got to remember to get our... Um, oh, really? One problem we are going to see is what just happened there, where our spiders are now so strong, it's going to be very hard for us to create web sacks. Cracked Orb is fine. In fact, Cracked Orb lets us do some interesting stuff if we wanted to. Well, wait until you can move into that and then kill you. Beautiful. Yeah, they're, they're quite often going to um, end up killing the enemy before we can web them. What on earth? Okay, that was close. I There was a button here that I didn't see that I stepped on that spawned this. That was close. That would have uh, ruined our beast opportunity. And it would have ruined our ability to go to... Um, to go to what's it called? The, um, the dark path. A lot of uh, lots of going on there, but you can see now with three web hearts, just getting one is is pretty awesome. I mean, this this hand is gonna die so fast. Yeah, I expected that. Really, I hate it when they do that. They sidestep and just dodge out the way of it. Yeah, you, you, you didn't have to do that, my dude. We haven't seen the um. Oh my, God, so many spiders. We haven't seen the um. Tinted rock yet? Oh, there it is. Really, that didn't blow it up. Good, good. Nice. Don't think I can get that guy yet. Our spiders are too quick. Um, we can just full card straight out of here, so let's, um, let's go do this. Wow, look at that damage. Take whatever we want here. Don't need that soul heart. Grab an item from in here, because why not? None of these are very good, I'll be honest. Um, oh, wait, actually. Curse of the Tower's pretty good, because we have um, we have Pyro. We'll take Curse of the Tower. Full card out of here, because we don't need to do Boss Rush. I, I was really worried then that we actually still needed to do it. <laughs> Curse of the Tower's actually pretty decent for us, because now when we get hit, it's like it's somewhat valuable to us. Because we're definitely not going to take any damage from it. Obviously, we're not going to heal either. 
but just not taking damage from it's enough. And yeah, this feels like a run where late game it's still really valuable to use a spool, which is not really that common with this character, I'll be, I'll be honest. It's kind of a, like one of the, the pitfalls of this character, in my opinion, that like, it's a really cool character with a really cool gimmick. It's kind of like Tainted Blue Baby, in the fact that, yeah, it's got a really cool gimmick, but the gimmick kind of falls flat in the late game, because you just don't really need it anymore. It carries, it like, heavily carries you through the early game and becomes very hard to utilize in the late game. Okay, this time let's just use this. I really don't like these guys bouncing around a big room here. Especially with Broken Murdom. They're actually kind of a kind of a big problem with Broken Murdom. We've got a tainted treasure room here, which could be interesting. We'll, uh, we'll check that out. Ooh, um, this is... Friendly flies and spiders no longer aut um, attack automat autonomously. What the hell? Flies launch themselves in the direction you're firing. Spiders will swarm towards nearby enemies you're aiming at um, and huddle close to you otherwise. Each time a friendly fly or spider spawns, two may spawn instead. Friendly flies and spiders deal knockback on contact. Friendly flies and spiders no longer attack... I, that sounds cool, but I'm sorry, but Hive Mind with this setup is just too good to give up. We're literally getting double damage in all of this. I cannot give this up. Sadly, not every single one of these counts towards the web sacks that we can get there. We got High Priestess and the Empress. I mean, I guess we can take the Empress. Didn't mean to use it in this room, but I guess that's what happened. <laughs> Oh, hello. It's always annoying when you get this guy on Gehenna. You little... Or, uh, mausoleum, should I say. We're still only taking half our damage at this point, so... We're still very much in the, uh... In the positives. And that's a lot of trinkets right there. I actually don't think any of those are worth taking. Though this is one of my rooms. This is just all the paper trinkets. One of my secret rooms. It's a pretty powerful one, but honestly, the paper trinkets aren't all that good. Some of them are quite quite niche. Right. Down we go. We didn't go to our item room, but that's fine. We can go on the way back. Spent it. It's gone. Just get over it. You mean it's gone? How can you have spent our savings? How can you have spent our savings? It's so hard to actually land our web in time now. Overcharge again. Um, I guess we might as well just do that now. And then here we've got Sigil of Knowledge or Seraphim. Seraphim's definitely better right now. Fill that up again. Ah, you. Okay. What was that? A oh, black sack. Okay. Just pills, unfortunately. Nothing too necessary for us. Now we do. We can grab our cracked key on this floor here from our item room if we wish. So we can get, yeah, let's grab it. Why not? Oh, it's, it's literally so impossible sometimes. Our actual, like, damage, like, that we have is really not all that impressive. We've only got 5.7 and 
uh, fire rate. So I don't actually know how the beast fight itself is going to go, but I'm essentially just going to result to using bombs and bombs only if things start to go sour. Which I feel like they might. <laughs> Okay, good. I mean, we'd still do good damage on our own, which is nice. We still have, like, blood clot in there and stuff. That one overcharge, just so I don't want to use that. I really don't want to use my book at all until I'm in the fight, because that's so many extra hearts. There's four extra hearts we can have in the fight. So I want to try and heal with the bed, if plausible, instead. Really? You see that? It made a gap right in the middle. I didn't hit a single bit of that web there. Frustration. Oh my god, I keep just getting it right through the gap. Right through the center. You need to confess your sins and become saved. Let his light inside you. Yeah, that was good. Everything else dead. Oh, God, yeah, I had a feeling I was going to get hit in that room. Okay, that was a good room. We got a luck penny back this way. I don't know why we'd need it, but I'm going to take it anyways. Okay, we're doing decent on the, the fly producing, fly producing, spider producing action here. Surprised these guys produce them. It doesn't recharge fast enough. <laughs> we're keeping a pretty constant army though, so that's fine. I could use that guy. I don't really need to though. Just stay still for that room. We got a few sacks back there. And a few more back here. Did they even pop? I might have left before they could pop. Broken Murdom doing its job right there. Boogerty is doing work as well. Thank you. I think um, my Blue Baby's only friend can also spawn the spiders too, which I didn't actually realize. Ramush, last floor. Looks like Beast is going to be taken care of here. Where are you going? Wait, wait. Ah, we lost a lot of spiders there. I'm really, I was really hoping to bring as many as I possibly could into the dogma fight with me, which looks like it's not really going to happen right now. I was really hoping to absolutely demolish dogma. Which, yeah, so far... That ain't happening. Come on. Give me some rooms where I can just create a bunch of them, please. Does this work? Okay, that that's a lot. That's a good amount. Let's let's bring that amount down with us. It's not a ton. I was hoping for more, but it's enough. I think the dogma fight is really going to be where we struggle most, I'll be honest. Got the bed to fully refresh our HP. Will it refresh it with soul hearts or web hearts? Soul hearts. I wasn't sure. We might as well go in with 9-9 bombs. Why not? I'm a little worried, I'll be honest. Oh. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> okay. Tainted deleted. Tainted uh, Arachnus being unlocked. Oh, Mother Spine is in here. I wouldn't expect that. That's a good item. I don't know why I didn't expect that to be the case there, but yeah, that was weird. <laughs> right. That was some bullshit. Okay, do remember we've got this going on, so we're going to get some extra bombs in there. We all also want to be basically constantly placing down bombs. Can use that to get some health back here. 
Ah, oh, that's some bullshit too. Take my sword off. Oh, for God's sake, he did this attack straight away. Whoa, he yeeted that bomb so far. I didn't even know he could do that. <laughs> Broken modem is just messing you about so hard. Oh my lord, I'm I'm getting hit a lot. Oh what? Broken Murdom! Why do you screw me, sir? Okay, that wasn't so bad. We took a lot of hits, but we came in with double charge, car battery, and um, satanic bible, so didn't go so bad. This is the area where I'm a little more worried. Because we can't really use bombs. And there's very, very, very little ways for us to spawn spiders. I reckon a few of these fights are going to be pretty tragic. I'm hoping that bugger tears just kind of carry us a bit. I mean, what we can do if, we, if we're, like, a bit risky is do what I'm doing now and get, like, obscenely close. But obviously that just risks us getting hit by a tier anyways, so not a great tactic. Also, I don't know when the web sacks would even pop if I make them. The room doesn't technically end. It didn't create them anyways. He's going down pretty fast. He's, yes, entering second phase. Killed all of you pretty quick. Finally lost my holy mantle. A lot later than I was expecting to lose it, I'll be honest. Okay, that wasn't so bad. I think we're okay now. I think we're pretty much okay now. And we are going to get a charge for the Snake Bible as well after this. Which puts us back up to full if we don't get hit in this phase. Which honestly, we can't get hit by the explosion, so I'm hoping to not get hit in this phase. I just think this one is going to be a little bit longer because we... Broken Murdom doesn't matter. Broken Murdom got me hit again. That is the one thing with Broken Murdom that is bullshit. It'll just hold a tear in midair and be like, meh. I'm just going to leave this here for a hot second. Normally it'd be moving, so you wouldn't expect it to be there, but I'm just going to leave it there. Chase me, boy. Chase me. You're off screen, my dude. You're off screen. Okay. Do we get a charge out of this? There you go. I'm wondering if sides have enough health for me to, um... Well, what are you doing, dude? Damn it. No, they don't. <laughs> I tried. This guy got wrecked. <laughs> me getting hit twice there just ruined him. Okay, the, he is pretty much dead. There you go. And onto the beast where I think the beast is going to get demolished just because bombs are so easy to hit him with. We can literally just hold the bomb button, essentially. Like, you literally just drop them and it hits them right in the mouth. And we can literally do this for the whole fight. And then there's bugger tears attached to him as well, which is kind of nice. Broken Murdom does fuck up this phase a little bit too. It makes it easier in some regards and harder in others. As you can clearly see. Okay. Into the last phase. Just to get some golden troll bombs, uh, some regular troll bombs on it, sorry. Just throw a few more on him, why not? And a few more, and a few more. <laughs> there you go. Easy kill on that guy. I hope you guys did enjoy. What a fun one, and I'll see you guys in the next one.